a really good one for them because they are well known for the use of their utility. So now we'll be getting the first encounter over here, but Grace got the second with just the dualis, but Sebi got another one. Cameron just down JBA gets Sebi, and now it's just a 2v1 situation where JBA will has a lot of work to do, but you can already tell. It's just pissed around, and this guy's already shown us that they are so good that they do know how to play this game. So, well, now JBA has a really difficult time, especially since he doesn't have a kid. So, I'm his goal at this point. He needs to make it worth it. Trying to look for a little bit of information while. Okay, now we're just trying to buy some time for Bigu Sarah to get that kill over DJ. Now in come to room. Oh my god, what a shot! We are really organized push outside. Try to pick and Vizgera gets the pick on Gris. And of course he'll try to push forward. Might get surprised by Maxwell down there. Fails the shot. This could have been a really key shot. Artao, of course. Trying to find a way in. Cancels the flash. Schools will take down Scar. He's get out. Of course, really close by. Turn around at the best moment for the flash. They can enter without with any feet. And JBA and Cameron will tie the situation up. But Zevi is just a killing machine over and over and over. Getting three kills. Economy wise. As we see school. Getting the pick on Scar, great shot right there, nice headshot, the interaction has started, Chris will take down Vizqueda, Chris will get taken down by Skulls, and just like that, we see a lot of fouling conference one by one, Cameron being the last man remaining standing on the team of Limitless, they all need to find a way, they need to find him, and it seems that he will try to get his chance to be six rounds in a row for Pain Gaming, pushing ahead on the scoreboard Once over again, Limitless. It's going to A. Let's just need to be oh my god on the right place at least cameron got a nice trace over his gold next gets the second oh. nice exchange over there it's a 3v2 but one of the players is some hands already and Biku sarah so fast got grease it down and once again maxwell just by himself in a clutch situation god Frisilla, what's going on here like uh, right now it's just so hard for me like to wait it's so perfect that they are trying to get the entry nice will from maxwell to get that first advantage pick so now it's just time for them to hold a little bit longer to so don't lose the patience over there but just the flashes are so on point for gaming and now maxwell gets the second but school's playing too close maxwell was able to take the third and this could be the one for limitless to take Shots yes, there as Cameron. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> so nervous. We don't even want to talk. Hard so it's left alone now. In the situation where Limitless were before, they're just one of their players. That's in a really difficult situation, but now we have the chance to do it. And Grace was just right Hold there and away from Lobby. Any kind of pressure, any kind of push, but no one from Middle this is going to move a minimum. So right now, good weight of smokes because Sarah getting race once again and getting the advantage over there. But it seems like they will take secret, some of them at least had two, while the rest will try to flank. This is just crazy because Limitless will have no way to leave. And that's it because Sarah gets him and he got the cow for the rest of the team. Just go back to the A side because Zera gets another one. Maxwell this time. AWP gets a gun, but now it's schools from trophy. And also, it's a 4v5. As of course Scar was taking what uh, uh, Scar's life was taken with a gun. Cameron course gets the kill on Hartzau. Zevi will get the intel with skulls to take down Cameron. Zevi will plant the bomb as JBA take down Bisguera on the background now it's even 3v3 we see that they faked a nice flash skulls will take down chris now back again with the slight advantage the incendiary grenade is going to take down skulls as he wasn't able to get away from the fire no 
Next, of course, we'll turn around at the best time. We'll take down one. We'll do here. We'll take down Maxwell. Yes. Quer yeah, ganhar 5 dólares de graça? Então entre agora no Skins Monkey, logo com sua Steam utilizando o link da descrição e clique em receber gratuitamente 5 dólares. E pronto. Se você tiver skins que não curte mais no seu inventário, o site é perfeito para você trocar suas skins que já enjoou em skins novas do seu gosto. Você vai ganhar até 40% de bônus utilizando o cupom ART para suas trades e dar uma moral pro canal, né? Agora não perde tempo, bora farmar suas skins novas para fazer aqueles highlights insanos. E lembrando, todas as trades de fevereiro vão ocorrer ao sorteio exclusivo. Para participar, é só enviar um print da sua trade no meu Instagram. Tamo junto, guys, e vamos para o vídeo de hoje. Sim, like the way they get the communication and also, I mean, even to pick everything, you know? Like they are helping each other the whole time and I think that's so valuable but now Grace Dar got the aggression. It was a nice like they know that once they lost like the lobby control, they need to actually start working from the outside. Grace just took a second for him over next. Just because Sarah and Sebi. Oh my god, Sebi just got Grace with Maxwell. Got him yes, Sabing. Doesn't hurt anyone. And seems like people say I first. Just prefer. So it's just the fact that they are playing so slow, but at the same time so tactically that it's been so difficult for Limpless to react. As, and just as I say that JBA will take down next and Harzao, Skull will take him out, and it's a 4v3. They might be able to do it at any at any given moment. Scar will take down Skar and Skull. Zebi will take down Scar, Cameron, Zebi, and that's going to be another round for Limpless. Four rounds. Important ones for them. And oh my god, that use of utility card Sao gets his card, but there is JBA who is just so ready to take the triple for him. He's also making an amazing job over there for Mini and. Asian spot. Right here. This might be changing up a bit as uh, JBA will get taken by surprise. Card taking out his own teammate next are down in a really quick round for Paint Gaming. On outside, we have four players already making their way to the smoke. But okay, just Maxwell got Biko Seda. It's time to try to work and keep moving to secret, but oh my god, with the damage, Maxwell ends up with just 58 HP, Chris 59. So it's their moment. But okay, his goal was too close. The JBA takes him down, so that's. Oh to make the, the job to put at least the things on their favor. Cards now is just 32 HP. Sebi, well, he's gone. And Cameron just took him down. So now Nyx has the back of Scar. Needs to get that kill. And of course... Shot. Oh, a couple of flashes. Kools will get a nice Ooh. headshot. Amazing. Cameron will get a double. On oh, his own teammate in Skulls will finish off the deal with a nice headshot on Cameron. Unfortunate situation oh there. Gosh. Of course, we'll see that <clears throat> slight advantage from Paint Gaming. The weaponry, of course, still shines for Limitless as they have two teammates, Scar and Grace, with the DAK. Sebi wants to get a headshot, but at the same time, to find a way to quite hit it. Arzao will get taken out by Scar. Grace will take down Skulls. Shot that won't miss, but won't be enough. That one surely won't miss. Zebi will take down Scar with a nice snipe. And now next is just waiting. Oh, Grace will be there. Will be taking the quicker route. And now 30 seconds remaining. Grace has 10 HP. He has the bomb. He might be going back inside side. We see the flash. We see the smoke. We see him standing. He's been so Oh, Holy, Zebi got him. Zebi got him just in time. Just with Eagle, so that's so unfortunate. Oh my god, the flash is completely blinded. It's called God Cameron down. But now it's just time for him to hide. He has the information. He knows that he could be super close, and Sebi gets the double from main. That was amazing for him to trade this car and JBA just trying to do the things even 2v2. And now Big up with really, him. Really, really putting a bad time into pain gaming but of course high risk high play reward right here by next yet again unfortunately won't be the high reward the one that will be coming out the final group will be the high risk playing into action as hard style will take them too now it's a slight advantage <laughs> never mind cameron will take down sebi and now the plan is going for b we see cameron and scar heading out to b maybe not big 
Because Zeta will take on camera. This might be it. It's really, really good job. So, for now, the situation seems we're playing a gaming to play. Okay, now the camera and go the advantage kill over schools. This is going to be important now that they are going to try to make their way through. Oh my god, from Benz, but Sebi just caught a good molly to hold them down. So now. It's a 4v4, things are even here, but next, I don't know if they're going to spec that angle. Actually, you try to... Oh my god, he was <laughs> able to take one. one. But okay, he took two, actually, Sebi, with the help over here from... A situation, Biscara might be able to get the pick on Maxwell. It's only one shot that he needs. It's only one tap. Ooh, Maxwell Ooh. will be the one one tapping Biscara, and now running into the smoke and planting. The bomb has been planted. This is a huge round for Maxwell. He needs to take one, down not one but two teammates from Pain Gaming, both almost at full health. Hartzau on 92 and Sebi on 68. We see the incendiary. Maxwell doesn't know where they might come from. He is holding down side. He's holding down sides, and Hartzau will get the quick pick. This is a game, ladies and gentlemen, for a gaming as they have now achieved. They are going to try to cross that, but they will finish this in Donald, but her sound just got Grace head. Now it's a 5v4 situation, and they have all the call and the information that they are in Donald. So now they're just trying to take a little bit more of information, trying to get ahead, but Big Zero now it's down after JBS kill. It was another important kill over there for Nyx. We just took a JBA. It's Cameron and Maxwell against four of these players. But now the pressure over there to plant Sebi just got another hit in Nyx. I mean, not one way. It was just so nasty. So now Grace was just waiting for him. Nothing more to do. One minute left. Still a situation for Limitless where they need to. I think it's a little bit different. Maxwell getting his full. I don't even know how he saw him. But yeah. Sometimes it works this way. But I like the pressure that Pain Gaming is doing on OB. Precisely. You know, like from Cave, also from Long. So. Good smokes also to try to just uh, gain some time, but okay, Grizz with that tap. Sebi is completely out of the equation now. Next against JBL as well, but oh my god, he managed to get the double. And Grace, oh, the timing over there oh, was not working on their favor. Had Sao just got Scar. Now it's just Nyx against two players from Limitless. Or it I mean, that's going to be around for Limitless. Advantage nice. at least. Oh my god, okay, JVA. This is a full of nice shots. He gets the second over next. No more frags for him after what he just did. Now it's cool. Got Gris. This is a 3v3 situation, but JVA already took one M4. So Bigu Sarah has all the information that they have the bomb, but now it's his time to get I the triple. Push. All a main, all the aggression. I love it. I love that he got just a first kill over Cameron. But now Scar with a nice headshot put him to sleep. But of course, they were not going to spec a school on the back. He just got the double. He had the information, but he couldn't get the second one. It's a 3v2 situation. Almost a really nice try from Pain Gaming with all the aggression. But at the end, I'm pretty glad that Limitless actually. Well, we're aware of their back. <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, and it was that trigger discipline that could have gave him an upper chance. Unfortunately, it wasn't the case. Bomb has been planted. It's a 2v3 scenario here. One man advantage for Limitless. We'll see if they are capable of pushing this in. Bisguera approaching site. Just around the corner. As next, we'll take down JBA. Bisguera on site. Close to the bomb. Might be able to get a pick. He's gonna Ooh, take down Maxwell and try to take down Scar. <laughs> and now next will be the one taking him out. He has the kit. He has a chance. He has a dream. This is a defuse that could put us on the edge of our seat. This could be it. And they get the defuse just in time. <laughs> okay. 
just literally insane. Nice flashes. They are just trying to make the damage, but now it's cool. They have at least the first skill. Nice flash from herself. Good trade from Maxwell as well. Now, they just three other players. Okay, great. Just got an important kill, but they'll they push the MP9s once again. The real enemy of the AKs just is started here. Wait, well. Maybe yeah, one player. Oh my god, Sebi just lost his head, but he doesn't have the bomb. And oh, okay, next. For the offensive and defensive, next gets the pick on someone, throws the smoke right there and tries to push in a couple of blind shots. Could we take down Maxwell? Could we take down Grace? JBI yeah, will take down Vizgera. And of course, this is still a little bit more than happening as the rest of the remaining teammates from Limitless Ads are all around to the. Map as next throws in the intel, knows that someone is there, but of course they need to check on A. They don't know. As Cameron is there, Cameron will take down Skull, will get caught red handed with the utility there, and unfortunately won't be able to follow through with his evil plan of throwing an incendiary grenade. Now it's a 3v2, paint gaming, of course, on the offensive rather than the defensive. Yeah, I mean, now, once again, things are getting a little bit too hard for Limitless, especially when they just have two players in life. 40 seconds on that clock, and plus JBS just sitting in HP so far south, where it just took him and his car wasn't able, or he did. Uh, took her south hat, so it's a 1v2, an AWP, but Nyx just has an MP9. And let me tell you, this play from Cave E could be really dangerous unless the car is super fast. But, as I say... Of course, Sebi will throw in the smoke right there on Chamber Lane. As he will turn around his attention, might run into Maxwell. He, because of the scope, he is not able to see it, but the Yutsu Throne will be the one giving away Maxwell location. And Sebi takes him down, 4v2. Uh, Sebi will try to find someone to come through his scope. Maybe getting oh a no scope gosh. right there. We'll get the kill on Cameron, but JBA will be quicker to get Sebi down and just with a couple limitless on the lower mid. A schools, of course, with the high reward, high risk, high reward. The Intel being thrown, Pain Gaming now on a through long. They might run into Sebi here. They did, but Cameron is able to take him down, and now it's a 1v3. It's going to be quite difficult as next has the full HP, has the kit, has an M4. Limitless will be taking their second round against Paint Gaming as the bomb detonates. And Maxwell and GBA takes a little bit of damage. Right now with all the information that they already have, this is going to be like a possible... Uh, we take of course that uh, there is a good exchange card. So just got a double over there. The JBA got the trade. Maxwell, another one, and this is a 1v2. They are just playing with Maxwell head right now. Unless he hit that shot. Okay, okay, because it is down. That could be really scary for Nick since he just has the mass. Not fast enough though. Next to case. This is a crucial round if they want to push in. And Sebi didn't notice the whole team is going to try and get what their teammates will get, of course. The very left taking down two of them from Limitless. Next, holding shot on sight. Cameron doing great damage. Uh, Harsao and Sebi. Next, will take down JVA. Grace will take down Next. Get will take down Grace. It's a 2v1. Limitless now charged only by Cameron being sandwiched over at sight. And Skulls into B side. Nothing to worry about. Skulls would take a little bit of damage. Next, we'll get taken down. No, we'll take down GBA and trade with the hit taken by ourselves. Skulls and next, we'll take the kill on Cameron and Chris, respectively. And this seems like a hard push for Pain as they want to demolish completely the limitless economy. Maxwell taking the kill on next spot with Big Zeta, and of course, taking it over Maxwell. It's a 3v1 a difficult situation as now Scar is approaching side the Intel have been forward to him but now he has to make a miracle play in order to take down every teammate from Fane Gaming getting a nice one time
We see how he's trying to move around. CT spawn. The schools is close. Both are on really low HP. And we just like that. Round over pain gaming. We see the molly. We see the flashes. There's no approaches. GBA on the edge of that door. Ooh, surrendering that fire. Now it's a 3v3 really quickly as we start seeing that pain game is starting to move really quickly. They're not wasting any more time. Kiskar will take down next. This might be good. Grace will take down Harzao. And this is what Limitless needs. A really quick interaction that helps them managing, focusing on where he might be able to find. This might be a straight interaction. Scar will get taken down because Sarah wasting no time. He might get flanked right here and right now by Grace. He is approaching ramp at that really fast pace. He has his side space. Now he found it and Bigusera will take down Grace. This is a really tense moment. Bigusera and Maxwell are both on a 1v1 situation. Maxwell approaching through ramp at any given moment. They might be able to cross crossers here and now. Six. A couple of moments left on the clock. As the bomb is approaching midway detonation. Bigusera is able to find it. He wants to go that for that quick reload. Maxwell trying to flank. He has an AWP. He has a little bit of a shot. And Maxwell gets the shot. Gets the kill on Bigusera. Has the defuse kit. Has nothing to worry about. Already belongs to Pain Gaming with his car. And Maxwell trying to see if he can catch someone. Trying to hold those angles. Sorry, will have a bigger oh. end opportunity of taking him down. And GBA and Scar, of course, taking Zebi and... Oh, respectively. And now GBA taking down Bigusera. Now Skulls. Last one remaining of Pain Gaming. Will throw in a flash, turns around. And unfortunately, Grace will take him right down. Right this seems to be good for them. They already have four players. Two of them playing from short. More just taking the advantage and Sebi all the time just trying to lurk and wait to be more specific for that aggressive push from the CT side. Now, Grace just got an important kill over next as well. Just trying to go back and Cameron just got his back. He was like, don't worry. I got her out and now it's at 3v4. But Limitless has full rifles here, so... Oof, so complicated, especially when you have 20 seconds now on the clock. I'm going to set up to put some pressure, but he just got Grace down. It's cool, what's already on site? A side is going to work out completely for them, and suddenly... This seems pretty possible, but Cameron just got the aggression. No one was actually holding that. And unfortunate, I am just up. And especially uh, in a match point situation where they do have the pressure. They have been in such a terrible position. But now with all the aggression, there is not actual problem. But Pico said at least, well, got the trade. JBS Molly. The other... The other side, it was a little bit different. Now it seems like uh, Sebi just got really uh, nice first kill, but Gris got the double over there. Alright, Sao gets straight, but now he's just alone against two players. Okay, what's going on? Yeah, he didn't find it. <laughs> it's just like. <laughs> it's complicated. The you know? sweet spot, the sweet yeah, spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the, the right in a specific one. Now, they know that he will probably be playing from main or behind that box. This is all about the timing, but they do have a smoke and now it's time for them to try to push. And Maxwell getting on the back <gasps> and he got him. What pain gaming is putting on the table, of course we see that now. The Brazilian team has pushed for A. Maxwell is going to be there. Cameron will take down Harzao. It's going to be difficult. It's going to be difficult here. They are one man down. Um, it's going to be planted. Next, finding the sweet spot. And find a way where he wanted it. And right before he can settle it down, he's going to get taken down. Cameron and Scar taking next. And he's get a respectively Sevi taking down Scar. But still, there's two of them alive. Three of them are at that side. The school would take down Grizz. Might want to get another one. Might want to get another one. But Cameron is quicker on the draw. Taking down Skulls. And now it's all down left to Sebi. Sebi has the opportunity to save. He is a little bit, it's a little bit of a difficult situation. Cameron was holding down the bomb, but will get taken down by Sebi with the AWP. 35 seconds on the clock remaining. Limitless is on the verge of taking us into an overtime. We see, of course, 
the aim of Zebi with that AWP. Trying to see if he can find someone. Flash out! Zebi will get the kill. Cameron, amazingly, Bob is get out. We'll trade there with GBA teammates. And that's going to be or 4v4. A nice trade. It's going to be difficult. We are now seeing that Zebi is going to be looking and moving. We will take the pick we'll take the pickle mass, we'll grace, we'll get another double, tying things up again. 2v2, the molly being thrown into CT lane. Hartzau, instead of planting, will take the long route. We'll go through Temple, we'll see if he can find someone. He will maintain the angle. The bomb has been planted, now the pressure is on Limitless. As now, it's all down left to GBA to do the magic, to do the trick, to do, of course, a nice, nice play. We'll take down Sebi, it's a 1v1. Harzao holding down side, holding down the bomb. GBA has a kit, has the magic to do, has is able to do it. We'll throw in the smoke into the bomb. Now Harzao will try to go for the pick. We'll see if he can get a dumb line pick. GBA defusing. Couple of shots into Harzao will take it.